He's a Grammy winning musician known to fans around the world as a member of Zach Brown Band, but music isn't the only passion for Coy Bowles. A good day's Paul Milliken recently stopped by Children's Healthcare of Atlanta at Hugh Spaulding to find out how Bowles is giving back through books. Let's count to four and open the door. One, two, three, four. This is a different kind of stage for Koi Bowles. Oh, look, the cat is on the ceiling. The Georgia native is best known as a member of the Grammy winning Zach Brown Band. Sweet tea, pecan pie, and homemade wine. But when he's not writing songs, he's writing children's books, starting with 2012's Amy Giggles Laugh Out Loud. One of the, the bandmates uh, is now his wife was uh, told me the story about how uh, she had a really crazy laugh when she was a kid and got made fun of and changed her laugh. So I went and uh, wrote a story about it and then came back and read it to Zach, who at the time had like four kids. So he was pretty, uh, pretty uh, knowledgeable about reading books to kids. And he was like, this is a really good story, man. You should do something with it. Since then, Bowles has published three other children's books. And recently, he donated a thousand of them to a nonprofit called Reach Out and Read Georgia. Whoa. Do we read you a book, man? Today, Bowles is handing out many of those donated books himself to young readers at really Children's now? Healthcare of Atlanta at Hughes Spaulding. Uh, like I could go and meet a fan of the Zach Brown Band and uh, and not be nervous at all because you know they came and paid money to see uh, the show, so you know that they love you guys. You know, so there's this instant kind of like connection with them. Whereas I get so nervous meeting kids because you know, like if a kid does, there's so much truth in kids to where if they're like, I don't like your beard. You know, you're like, oh. <laughs> the mission of Reach Out and Read Georgia is to partner with healthcare providers to promote reading. Doctors like Terry McFadden say books are a necessary prescription for every child. You know, we do a lot in the well child visit, yeah. but one of the most important things we do is to prepare kids to, to be ready for school, ready to learn, and that, that means that they're healthy physically, but they also um, have those pre-literacy skills yeah. that are so important. And while Koi Bowles may not be performing for thousands of screaming fans today, he did get this very big smile. And really, what could be better than that? In Atlanta, Paul Milliken. That is yours. Thank you. Thank you for letting me read it to you. Good day, Atlanta. Now, if you're interested in finding out more information about Reach Out and Read Georgia, you'll find a link on our website. Just look for the story under the Good Day section of Fox5Atlanta.com. Coy's right. Kids will say anything. Yes, they will. They tell the truth. <laughs>